Hi, I'm Dan. Today we're going to introduce you to the Ultrafin Radiant Floor Heating System, a simple, powerful radiant system that's remarkable for its ease of installation and relative low cost. Now we're going to walk you through the basic installation steps in this two-story house behind me here, and at the end we're going to show you three different layouts for how to install the system using a high temperature boiler, a modulating boiler, or a thermal heat pump. So if you got a minute, let's go. It's warmer in there. Ultrafin is designed specifically for wood frame construction. With Ultrafin's four zone valve controllers, the water is directed through half inch pressure tubing suspended just below the floor sheathing in the joist spaces. As hot water moves through the tubing, the heat is conducted to lightweight louvered aluminum plates attached to the tubing called Ultrafins. The Ultrafins radiate the heat into the air space between the joists, creating hot air convection. The hot air in turn warms the entire floor, converting it into a giant radiator which transmits comfortable uniform heat throughout the living space above. Okay, here we are, we're uh, getting things ready. This is Casey and Malcolm, and they're doing a little measuring. Because the first step with Ultrafin is to design a layout for your fins and your tubing. Now Ultrafin's installation manual will show you how to lay out your system based on your joist spacing and the Ultrafin UltraCalc software will then help you calculate how much tubing you're going to need and how many fins. Ultrafin allows you to install your tubing either by running parallel with the joists or by drilling and running through the joists. In this example, the guys have drilled all their holes and are now pulling the tubing through the joists. When you run your tubing loops, Ultrafin recommends that you run them no longer than 300 feet each from supply to return. This ensures that you get optimal heat over the length of each circuit. So, your other option in laying your tubing is to do it parallel with the joists. And if you do that, then you're going to hang it from the sheathing with snake hangers. Now they've done this half of the room, the guys are now going to do the second half of the room. It's important that you start in the middle, do one half, then the other, that way you don't have to pull the tubing through everything all at once. Malcolm and Casey have gone off to work on another room, but we've got another one of our crews here. This is Stephanie and Sarah. And they're going to help us by demonstrating how easy it is to put on the fins with Ultrafin's new turnkey system. So, Sarah, go ahead and give us a demo. Basically, you just line up the fins, in goes the key, give it a quarter turn, and that locks it in place. Now, well, wasn't that easy? It's just that easy, Dad. Pretty simple. The other way to do this is to run your tubing parallel to the joists. If you do that, then you're going to suspend it from the floor sheathing using snake hangers. And Sarah here is going to show us how simple they are to put in. Just like that. When insulating your rim joists, McDuffco recommends using styrofoam insulation pre-cut to fit each space. Once you've got your styrofoam pieces cut, it's a simple matter to just snug fit them in against the rim joists. And if you do have any gaps, you can fill them in later with some spray foam insulation. Good work. Once you've insulated the rim joists, you insulate the entire system from underneath and you're ready for wallboard. One of the best features of the Ultrafin system is its flexibility in working with different boilers. If you're using a high temperature boiler, your layout will need the least amount of fins over the total area. This is called the Ultrafin High Temp System. If you're using a modulating boiler, your layout will use a few more fins over the total area to increase the heat distribution for the lower operating temperature. We call this the Ultrafin Modulating System. 
Our installation here is just about complete. This is where the manifold will go. All the tubing lines are running down here. What we want to do now is show you a few different installations so you can see what it looks like when it's all installed. For instance, in this room, you can see the electrical and the plumbing is all in. The tubing lines are running through the joists. And we want to show you another installation just so you can get an idea of what that looks like over in this room. This is the room where Sarah and Stephanie were demonstrating to us the new Ultrafin snake hanger and the new turnkey that holds the fins on. And you can see in this room all the tubing runs parallel to the joists. Sarah and Stephanie have helped to give us a quick overview of the Ultrafin system. As you can see, it's simple to install, goes together quickly and easily with basic tools. If you're planning on installing Ultrafin, be sure to consult the Ultrafin installation manual and match the design specifications to your home. Ladies, thank you very much for coming over and helping us out. Can we expect to see you again anytime soon? Absolutely, of course. All right, we'll call you for our next project. Thanks, have a good trip. To find out more about the Ultrafin Radiant Floor Heating System and its related products, visit our website at www.ultrafin.com. Ultrafin. Comfortable heat through proven technology.